Claimed by Martial and Rashford played in against Allison here. Marcus Rashford scores. No flag. 2 0. The classic counter attack. It was absolutely unbelievable that game. Argentina, Brazil, uh, France. You remember it, do you? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Louis Sahar catching up with an old mate, Jamie Redknapp. Oh, you see, you see, Gary, Jamie Carragher will tell you that's what happens if you speak against Cristiano. We're off the Christmas card list, aren't we? <laughs> <laughs> you know, it's a great football club, it's a magic football club, it's been the biggest thing in my life and I couldn't be sort of more proud to support the club. But at this moment in time, it is really desperate, really, really desperate. There's no leadership, there is no voice, you can't blame, you know, the individual player or the manager. You know, you've got to look above. You have to look to the very top now. I thought United first half showed authority. Do so you think Man United was a better team in the first half? I do. Not a chance. You look at them gloating like little children. No, you just can't come up no, with a daft remark. My point is, no, Liverpool look, didn't play Liverpool well today. Five, I've still Liverpool for five, six years, and they put in some of the best performances that I've ever seen. They're still not back anywhere near that. No, level. but did Liverpool play well today? They played all right in the second half. No problem. They won the game seven. You said they didn't play very well. Well done. Congratulations. Look, Arsenal finishing second would still be an unbelievable season. You never, that wouldn't be Gary. Well, no, 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 not, 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 not now would, anymore. Oh, no, no, Gary, not now anymore. It. Leicester fighting for the lives against Everton, Leeds and Nottingham Forest to try and avert relegation. Is avert a word? Avert, <laughs> 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 isn't it? <laughs> That's what it is, it? Dic okay. Dictionary of averts, Gary. Averts? Prevent or ward off an undesirable occurrence. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's what I want to do. <laughs> Avert relegation. <laughs> there you go. They're going to get peppered, those players. The coach, the sporting department, the new CEO, they're all going to get peppered. But there's a family over there in America who are just literally letting their employees take all the hits for them. And that is unforgivable. They've got to get on a plane. Joel Glazer has got to get on a plane tomorrow. He's got to get over to Manchester and he's got to start to divert the issues away from the club and tell everybody what the hell his plan is with the football club. What is he doing? On a lighter note, it is a Football Share Friday for a great cause. And I saw some of the Arsenal fans earlier outside the ground and I spotted a couple of nice uh, Arsenal shirts I hadn't seen before. Oh, there you go. Yeah. I've worn that one. Uh, yeah. There you oh, go. Oh, there he is, there he is. Yeah, Gary and Phil joined at the hip again. A, why do we have you in an Arsenal shirt? We were a very poor team, Kelly, and we just got some sort of, from the local, uh, what's he got, in, Intersport in Bury. <laughs> Give us Arsenal shirts that hadn't been sold from the year before. That's my brother. <laughs> Phil, that's Phil, by the way, next to me. That's Gary. That's a young Gary Oh, you'd never guess. <laughs> <laughs> so that, 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 that's the one he said he's going to put on again. <laughs> oh, they get on the Arsenal fans here. You want it on now? <laughs> Clubs have to pick an identity, pick a group of players that fit an identity, and then bring a coach in that fits that style. That's the ideal scenario. I'm not saying you always get it right, but Everton have moved from one end of the spectrum to the other. They've got no consistency, they're all over the place, and I have to say, you've got to start looking at the players, to be fair. They are a shambles. I mean, some of their mistakes that they're making, they're experienced players, some of them, by the way. We're there to win leagues, we're there to win a game. People might call it cheating, but you can't put your hand in someone's eyes with a clasp like it that. It wasn't in his eye. But what if that is one oh, of your old forwards? Was was playing. You're playing How like could that not be in his eye? Yeah. Both fingers. I mean, you can see one finger in one eye and the other one's in the other. Oh, that's the one they wanted. That is the cherry on the icing on the cake. Bobby Dazzler, Bobby Firmino. You might lose 2 0, you might lose 2 1, you might lose 3 1, you don't lose 7 0. You do not get beat 7 0 at Anfield if you're a Manchester United team or player. You do today. <laughs> One. He's probably the most talked about fullback of probably all time, certainly in the Premier League era. Well, that's a good and the thing. I know. But the, <laughs> I've but been the reason, 20 years and no yeah, mention my name. Exactly. <laughs> but the reason no one wants is, to be a Gary Neville. Everyone wants to be a, everyone wants everyone to be wants Trent, to be a Trent Alexander Arnold. <laughs> When someone said to me it's an American programme about English football with American characters, I thought, I'm not sure I'm going to like that because I'm not a great watcher of television. Then when I actually started watching it, <laughs> I really got into it and my girls watch it with me. So yeah, it cuts across sort of different age groups and uh, generations. And one of the nice things about it is that they have all of Sky's top talent on it as well. Apart from me. <laughs> no, no, no. They <laughs> have all of Sky's top talent on it. <laughs>
<laughs> just look at me when I'm talking to you. We didn't win the league for 30 years, Jamie, right? You've so got the players but we the went break. through it. No, I'm not going to count the players, but I'm saying, but they have to take responsibility. When you're well, a player, do you think, oh, why would I wonder times, what Joel Glazer's doing how tomorrow? Many times, I wouldn't care unless how many times you have to do better for the team here? when you play. How many times are we going to sit here and say those players need, uh, lack leadership, personality? They well, need to, how many times are you going to keep saying, go get rid of the owners? No, but they've proven it. They've proven They've spent a billion pounds on the team. They've proven they can't handle it, these players. So they needed to have a good transfer market. They've not had a good transfer market. It was Edward's fault. He's now gone. Whose fault is it now? It's, it's always... But when, when the business is failing, it's not performing. It's the owners of that business. It's really simple. I think they've been getting away with it. And they've still got a lot Graham, of work Graham, to that's do. A, that's a nonsense, Graham. That's a nonsense. They beat that's my opinion. They beat Your Barcelona. opinion is that they, Liverpool they, they didn't beat play well they beat, today. They beat Barcelona, who were the top of the Spanish league, and yeah. they beat them really well over two games. They beat the, them really the, well. The, the, they're playing every three days. They've performed every three days. Even the game they lost to Arsenal, they played well. I'm sorry, I watch Manchester United mm. a lot more than you do, and that's and, nonsense. And I saw Arsenal go that's to Trafford and should have beat Man United right. at Arsenal. Honestly, they played honestly. Months ago. You've got to give credit to the team that wins seven. I've given you credit, James. You won 7-0. Congratulations, you've got three points. Well done. Call you James before. Yeah. The problem Liverpool have got, the other teams Mike has just mentioned are a lot more stable than Liverpool right now. Manchester United and Newcastle are definitely two of them. Dave, the two teams. biggest things for Liverpool are keeping Jurgen Klopp and getting new owners. The right new owners. They don't need new owners. <laughs> That's a longer they, conversation for they, another they, day. But we just leave it on. They've won absolutely <laughs> everything you can he's win. He's selling, the club. He's, he's selling the club. No, no, no. They're selling the club. Hang on. They're there. They don't They're need selling the club. No, but even if they don't go, Liverpool have had owners who, and the club have won absolutely everything. Being clever in the transfer market, not just blowing money like your the club. Clubs, That's absolutely nonsense. I, I, think, I feel like you're rewriting history here. You were right. a horrible defender who used every single dark art that was available and wanted your players in your team. You appealed for every decision more than anybody else that ever played. And if your strikers went down, you wanted them... If your play, strikers went down, like, you'd want him sent off and you'd probably have a go at him if he didn't. I that, wouldn't. Now you're talking no, as the pundit with a suit no, on no, no, on the no. Monday night. It's fine. It's a better but, suit than that. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it's all right, actually. Who's on the right wing? Cancelo, right wing. No chance. He was deeper he was. than a right winger or there. He was miles deeper. He than, well, uh, we'd have to watch it back. He no. was deeper than Cancelo was. What are you so, doing tomorrow? Right, right. <laughs> <laughs> so, so that's what it's, it's Nunez, not Nunez. I think you'll have just found. We've just found out. Haven't we? Did you say Nunez? And he said Nunez. We get this. The, we get this lovely video sent from the Premier League, which has got all the players and the managers saying their own names. Except so Nunez. We shouldn't get it wrong. <laughs> no, he's on there. Darwin Nunez. By the way, it's Gary Neville. <laughs> <laughs> Gary to start with to pick his combined Manchester United 99 treble winning side with this current Manchester City group and this is what Gary has come up with. <laughs> Spot the city oh, players. Do, 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 no, 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 no. There's, 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 there's two can, can things. You, the reason, the reason I'm picking this team is because this is the team that has done the treble. Na 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 na